rice production and the Food and Agriculture Organization country representative Jocelyn Brown Hall says Ghana has the potential to be a leading rice producing country in the world. In her estimation, the only reason the country is unable to be a global rice producer is the failure of successive governments to formulate the right policies to complement its natural resources and human assets. Among the natural resources Ghana is endowed with, is endowed with is the vast arable land suitable for the cultivation of all tropical crops, rice inclusive. Yet the country depends on imported rice to feed her people due to low production of the commodity. Importation of rice in Ghana takes 82% of all imports into the country. The country spent $1.1 billion on rice importation alone in 2018, according to statistics available to the Trade Ministry. Yet the land and the people have consistently demonstrated their readiness to feed the nation with locally produced rice. The ongoing crisis situation at the various rice farming areas in the country speaks volumes. The question then is why the country is not taking advantage to ease itself from excessive import pressure. The disconnect in the view of the Food and Agriculture Organization FAO country representative Joycelyn Brown Hall is as a result of weak policies. Most people don't think of agriculture as being a technology driven sector. And changing culture and changing methodologies in rural areas for people. She thinks a strong and united rice farmers organization can force negotiations for better laws. Again, you're, you're moving um, a whole sector of people to change their behavior in terms of using technology for prices or for production or for even for weather and that's Joyce Brown Hall was speaking with some journalists at the FAO's country office in Accra.